Good morning and welcome back to the channel or welcome if it's your first time around here. We are in, sorry, just had a message coming through. It's not important. We are in uh, Ostritza today. Now, I've never ever sold a house in Ostritza yet. Uh, it's because I haven't listed any here. Um, but I've heard lots of very, very nice things about it. People keep talking about this village to me. Um, there's some really nice people who live here who I do know. And so I thought, let's give it a go. It's a little bit far out from Popvo. It's half an hour drive. Um, but what a beautiful, lovely village. I must say, now I've been here and I spent a little bit of time exploring, um, I can see why people like it. It's nice. So, got a house today to show you that's extra nice. It's nicer than nice. It's, it's, it's lovely. Here it is, all very, very modern. Um, let's start Let's start with the boring bit, shall we? It's not boring. None of this house is boring. It's all very, very exciting. Just some bits are more exciting than others. So let's start here. Yeah, there. We have a garage, somewhere to park your car off the road. Nice, big, proper concrete construction garage. Uh, they've had all brand new electrics here, all throughout the whole house. Everything has been completely and fully rewired. Um, I say new, I think she said it was year before last, so um, not brand new, but you know, updated, working, recent, uh, what's another word for not quite new, oh, I'm not going to close that because I can't, we'll do that a bit later, very nice house, check out the stone base, it looks really nice, it's all been repointed, very, very lovely, um, a nice bench to sit on it, just what a nice area, if you can hear someone's playing their music over there. Not too loud, it's, it's nice, gentle, relaxing music. You, you can't hear it on tune through the gate. Um, so again, nice off-road parking here. Nope, that's the neighbors, ignore me. <laughs> A nice walk-through gate here. Um, now, here, this is what you really need to see. This is where the money's at on this one. Oh my, look at those views. Oh, just lovely. Now, back to the house. Um, air conditioning, uh, UPVC everything. Um, everything has been upgraded, renovated, made extra special beautiful. Come through here with me. It's a really nice space, this. I tell you what, I do feel very calm here, very relaxed. Um, it's just a calming space. Oh, look, Buddha agrees with me as well. See, it's not Buddha. Um, it's Shiva, whatever her name is. She looks very relaxed there as well and her over there. It is a relaxing space. Uh, let's do the garden first quickly, and then I'll show you the best bit, which is the house, of course. So, we've got loads of fruits here. I'll see if I can remember some of them. Apples, plums. I can only remember those two, but there's more. I'll write them in the description. Apples, plums, apricots, uh, hazelnut, and one or two others. Um, very nice space here, a really good garden. It's all completely fenced and enclosed, so your dogs will be okay. Um, it's a good space, it's only 780 square meters. So not a lot of lawn to look after. You know, you get out there once every fortnight, take a half an hour to mow this lawn. Um, not a lot of maintenance, but a very, very nice garden, a very nice space. Outstanding views, absolutely just outstanding. Right, let's show you a little bit around here quickly before we get into the house now. Um, so, so a little section of this land, I think sort of back to that wall is, is part of this property. So you can make that into a little chicken coop or something, somewhere to keep your animals. Um, or this could be a chicken coop, let's have them free range, eh? Let them have this garden. Keep your chickens out in the garden, they'll find something to eat. And they'll... So a little sort of what I'd call a log store there. It's a little building, you could do something with it. Or you could just keep your logs in it. Don't have to do anything with it if you don't want. And the classic. You can't have a Bulgarian house without an outdoor dunny. Oh, it's a posh one. It's got a Western toilet in there. Don't worry, there is an inside toilet. That's just for if you're caught short out in the garden. Uh, so again, good spaces out here. Uh, I think that's access into that little log store that we just saw there. Um, more log store. Uh, you could store your tools here. Now with this house, if the asking price is met, everything, and I mean very almost everything, um, apart from some of her music equipment, some personal items and the small television and little bits and bobs she wants to take with her. Lots and lots of things will be included with this house uh, if you meet the asking price. And the asking price is a bargain. But anyway, even without them freebies. Um, so it, it's just everything you see, the ladder, uh, it, the strimmer, uh, the tools, the gardening tools, everything you need, literally just bring your bags and you've got it all here. You won't have to provide any extra supplies. Apart from music, if you want your own music, and, um, and a small television. 
Now look, here's a good room. This could become, uh, what could it become? Um, an annex, a guest annex. What I would do with this, I'd make it all nice and pretty. This would be the room. Oh, we've also got uh, the, ele the new electrics also extend all the way out, uh, way to out here and further and beyond, all through the house, in the garage, in these barns outside, uh, everything all done properly, properly, properly as it should be. So look, and then you've got this space here. You've got plumbing. This used to be the shower here. So this could become a washroom, but it could become a little bedroom. You could even knock a hole, knock a door in there to kind of connect it all together. So potential, there's work to be done here if you want to, but there doesn't need to be any work done because the house is all done and it's absolutely fabulous. It's lovely, it really is. Um, well, where should we start with sport for choice? We've got two doors, front one and the back one. Let's go in through the back, shall we? So everything very, very nicely done in here. Oh no, this is a separate, separate annex. Hang on, I forgot about this. Gosh, it is good, this house, actually. Great, great value. I'm so glad that the owner has decided to, um, to put a, a, a decent price on this one. She, she's motivated to sell. She wants it gone. So we've discussed, it, I, I, you know, I think it could easily achieve 60 plus. Um, we're going to put it on at 49 to get a quick sale for her. And I'm sure it will get a quick sale. So this here is uh, it's like a guest annex. You've got a log, log, log wood. Look, what have you got? It's a petka. It burns wood and it makes, makes the room nice and hot. Pretty, I do like the artwork. Um, nice space, very, very good. We've got nice, very nice sort of wood effect floor tiles. Um, they are very, very nice. The whole space is being renovated fully and very, very well as well. Very, very nice space here. Um, again, through here, I don't know what's in here. Do you look? Oh, I don't, come on, let's have a quick. Oh, yes, I do. I did look, I forgot. I've got a cellar, look. So this could be converted. Into, and it's almost icy cold down here. This You wouldn't need a fridge here, actually. You could keep your milk down here. Uh, it's very, very nice and cool. Really nice, original stone. Uh, it's been pointed up. It, it's a good, clean area, free of damp. It smells fine down here. Uh, you could turn this into, uh, well, come on, use your imagination. It could be your dungeon if you're into that. Um, loads of possibilities. Back up these stairs, and now we're gonna go into, oh God, a bit of a cobweb on me. We're gonna go and check out the house. I can't wait to show you this house. I think this represents just amazing, amazing value. It's amazing that you can buy a house like this for under 50,000 euros. Um, you wouldn't be able to renovate it on that cost with the, with the price of materials nowadays. Um, so look, very nice space. I could sit and have a rock in that chair and just chill out for a bit. I won't because uh, I wanna show you around the house, maybe later. So again, everything UPVC, and she's gone above and beyond here. We've got the triple glazing, um, what they call it, four season glass. Um, very, very nice. And all of the windows, they do that whole thing where they tilt a little bit, they've got fly screens. Um, everything has done, been done really with lots of thought and care here. It's been very well carefully thought about. The kitchen, look, what a great space. It's absolutely huge. Not a small kitchen at all. You could also, you've got space here, definitely for a little kitchen table or something like this if you wanted. Um, all fully equipped, and again, almost everything stays. All of the big appliances are staying. She's just gonna take what she can fit into two bags and, and her music equipment. Wait till you see music equipment, this looks cool. Go on, let's do this room next. Look at this, I'm not gonna walk around in here too much because I'm sort of person I'll fall over and break some expensive stuff. But look, she's got her own great setup there. I love to sit there and have a little jam for half an hour. Got a piano as well. I might see if she give me a little lesson before I go. I do need to brush up a little bit. So anyway, let's back. To, stop talking about me. It's about the house. Back to the house. Uh, these as well. These are fantastic. Um, what do they call them? Not uh, in, infrared. Infrared heating. Oh, I was just saying about the windows. Look, they tilt like that. So let me show you these windows because they are nifty. They're worth paying the extra for, I think. So you can open it out like that. Fly screens there. So you don't got to worry about any of the insects coming in. Lift that up, and you can open it like that. It's just nice. Um, so yeah, what was I saying? Infrared, very, very good. Um, it kicks out some beautiful heat. It feels like the proper proper summer. Now they do have air con here, which blows out hot air. Um, so it keeps it very, very nice and cool, icy cool in the winter. And it does heat it in, in the, sorry, it keeps it icy cool in the summer. It'll keep it icier in the winter, but um, better off to have the cold on in the summer. And in the, in the, in the winter, turn the, turn the hot on. Now see, it does heat the whole house, um, but those, and there's one here as well in the kitchen. Let me just show you again. These infrared ones, though, they kind of make it like a real summer heat. They, they, you know, they make you feel warm from the inside. Woo! Um, not just yet. So, loads of heating. Now look, nice bathroom. 
walk-in shower, fully tiled, and I mean fully tiled all the way to the ceiling. Um, very, very clean, very, very well done. Um, in fact, I know the builder that she used for this um, for this renovation here, and he, he's very, very good. He's from my own village, and he's highly, highly, highly recommended. He's always very, very, very busy, so she was lucky to get him in, really. Um, nice, good, light, airy space. Windows out onto the front road. Um, good, nice. And again, nice, great, big, long entrance hallway. This house is really, really nice. Um, laminate flooring all the way through. Um, she's gone for the good stuff as well. I know where this laminate comes from. Um, all the way through, apart from uh, in this room, she's used, not laminate, what do you call it? Um, vinyl, lino, um, just because it absorbs the sound a little bit, a bit better. So it's all about acoustics in that room. She's thought about it very, very well. Um, I think that's us about done. I will tag on another video doing kind of a first person view walk around where I can pan around and show you all just how beautiful this house really is. Um, and a look, beautiful dog as well. Is he gonna come and say hello? No, he's run off now. Don't worry about the dog. You're not buying the dog. It's, he keeps running away from me. Uh, but they, there you go, there you have it. And just for the very last time, in case I didn't mention it, look at those views. It's stunning. It really is just such a nice space. I might just chill out here for an hour before I go on to the next one, actually, and just uh, just enjoy myself. It's just nice. Okay, I hope you've enjoyed this house. Did I say the price? Absolute bargain at €49,000. Can you believe it for a house this well renovated? Well, believe it because it's true. Uh, you all know the number. Give me a call. It's 0899 527 801 uh, or email yoursonhomes at gmail.com. bonus footage for you we're just on our way back from a stritzer uh we're starving hungry i've got my eldest son driving for me um 
feeling a bit lazy this morning. Um, and we've just popped in at the pool. I've always thought it was called Fats. I've always called the guy Fats. They've just put up a new sign. His name must be Fitz. I hope I haven't offended him. Sorry, Fitz. Um, anyway, just want to show you this area quickly because it's a lovely, lovely pool. We're only 15 minutes from Palomar, so we're 15 minutes from Estritza. And this is what you've got. It's normally a lot nicer than that. They're not open yet. They're just prepping. They're doing a bit of building work. They're sorting the pool out. Um, it's not usually green like that. They're not really open yet. Um, but we came in and the owner's a lovely, lovely lady. She likes us a lot. And I told her, look, we're starving hungry. Uh, what are we going to do? And she said, don't worry, I'll cook you something. They're nice like that here. They're not even open. Um, and she's made us some very, very nice chicken soup, a plate of chips, and some garlic toast. So that was lovely of her. And yeah, I just want to show you this, just because it's right on your doorstep. Also from Palomar, so you've got two more pools in Popvo. I'll show you them another day as well. So lots and lots to do around here. Um, like I say, it's usually beautiful here. It's really, really nice. They're not quite set up yet. We've got another couple of weeks until they've officially opened. But if you're passing, pop in, ask nicely, and she'll cook you up something to eat. There you have it, it's nice. And look, look, little pool bar. It is nice in the summer here. Sit down there, have a little relax. Um, have a bit of a swim. It, it's lovely. People do like weddings here. They do all sorts of special functions. It's a great big hotel behind it. Um, and this is in Opaka, which is right smack bang in between Popovo and Astritza.